I'm Jane Tyndall and many of you will remember my time at Merchant Taylors Girls School as your deputy headmistress. I arrived in 2006 and I retired in 2018. I think people will remember that I was sort of viewed as the person who you were sent to when you'd perhaps been not being as good as you could have been. And um, the fact that so many young women now keep in touch, don't shrink into a doorway, do actually shout out to see me, again, suggests to me that the, the relationships that there were between staff and young women. One of my favorite phrases was, I am not your friend, I'm your deputy head. But I am thrilled and delighted by how many friendships have come from that. And now I come across women very, very established in their career that I've taught. And I feel very, very proud of that. A friend of mine once said to me, she um, has recently retired from the world of international banking. And she said, Jane, I moved money around. You impacted on young women's lives. And that sort of gave me a warm feeling. I'm always terribly proud that I was a member of the Religious Studies Department. And I know there are young women out there watching me now, I hope, who will remember Mrs. Vaughan and Mr. Brian Wilson with as much affection as I do. Um, you'll be pleased to hear that we are a lunch club. So the three of us are in touch and still see each other very, very regularly. And I think past that, it would be invidious of me to pick out any particular people, but I, I had some very, very good close friendships across all of the departments that I worked with. Sometimes isn't it difficult that people will say, your school days are your happiest days. And from what I experienced here, I know that for some of you, that may not necessarily have always been the case. There will have been times when the last thing you will have thought that you want to do in the future is come back to merchants. But I think with time, hopefully, all of us can look back and see that what was wanted here for you was that best of your very self. And if you have the chance to think about that, and if you have that opportunity, because now, and I appreciate the last 18 months has been something that none of us ever expected. But if you're in that position that you are able to think of young women coming after you who would benefit from the type of care and nurturing that you received when you were here, that you could perhaps think now is the time to come back, to make some contact, maybe organize a year reunion. If you do, make sure you invite me. I'll be cross if you don't. And, and think about the ways in which you could add to the school, because I think, what a weird number, a 401st anniversary, not the 400th. We'll look back at, uh, at that and wonder, won't we? But think about what you could do to help.